And it's that time of the year. If you fall through a patch of ice, do you know what to do? Today we got to tag along with state police as they demonstrated the steps you can take to keep yourself safe. The Dallas Mike Pelton joins us live. And Mike, you spoke to a man who says these tips are something that everyone needs to hear. Yeah, well, Candace, the water in this pond clocks in around 36 degrees, and authorities say if you fall through a sheet of ice, you have about a 10-minute window to physically have the strength to pull yourself out or to have somebody else throw you a lifeline like this throw bag and pull you to safety. To lose somebody to something like that is, is just an astronomical flip. David Andrzejewski is nearly a year removed from the loss of his good friend, 43-year-old Brian Persinger, who died in January after falling through ice in Johnson County, authorities say, in an effort to save his dogs. It's a freak accident, you know. You just never, never be by yourself around that environment. You know, the dangers of it, understand it, know it. State police say each year they respond to roughly a half dozen deadly incidents where people fall through ice. You're going to have about 10 minutes of active survival before your muscles get cold and fatigued. State police are hopping in, showing you what to do if you fall through ice. With 36-degree water, first control your breathing. Face the direction that you came. Place your elbows up on top of the ice. Use your elbows to crawl as you're vi kick or kicking vigorously with your feet and try to swim up onto the ice and pull yourself up onto the ice shelf. And then roll to distribute your weight. If you see someone fall in, authorities say you should stay on the shore to not risk becoming a second victim. Rather, throw an object to the person like a throw bag or reach out to them with an available item like a shovel. But you also to avoid um, body to body contact because they might pull you in. They are safety tips David hopes help save a life. Just be safe and everything. Watch your animals. You know, if you got ice, you know, you got open water around you, have them on a leash, keep an eye on your kids, because it can happen just like that. Now, throw bags cost as little as 10 to 20 bucks at the store, and state police say if you are going to venture out onto the ice, you need at least four solid inches of it. They say you should also always go prepared. We're going to run through a list of tips and what you should bring with you coming up tonight at 6 o'clock. For now, we're live on the east side for the Now Indy, Mike Pelton, RTV6.